So I'm Marshall Zelaznik. I am three weeks into the CEO role at Glory. I um, had previously been at Activision Blizzard working on esports in the Overwatch League. And prior to that was a little over 10 years at the UFC in various positions, but primarily running our international business there. It's really a unique opportunity to be able to join the company now as it, it's delivering its 50th event. It's um, the fight card that the matchmakers have put together is awesome. I'm really excited to be here. Chicago's a fight town. Um, in the past, I've been to events here. I know what the crowds get like. I've seen the past glory events from Chicago. Um, so it's a unique moment to be able to join a company at the moment it's celebrating sort of the history that's come before. And, uh, I feel really fortunate to be able to be in Chicago, to be able to see these great fighters compete uh, in front of a, a town that loves its fights, so it's a big deal. I've always been a combat sports fan, of course it wasn't called combat sports to me back then. I was a boxing fan as a kid growing up. Um, I boxed a little bit as a kid and was always taken by boxing. I loved, I didn't know this as a kid when you're watching it, you just sort of like what you're seeing. And, but I like the competition between two athletes and sort of being exposed out there. It's just them against each other. I was always pretty athletic. I liked playing sports. Um, and then was offered a job to get into pay-per-view and started working directly with the UFC and boxing Don King, Bob Arum, everybody. And I was now deep into this combat world and ultimately joined the UFC, became a big MMA fan as a result. Didn't join there as a big MMA fan. Um, always appreciated the stand-up quality and kickboxing for me, especially Glory, was something I got really introduced to when we were launching Fight Pass. Uh, we did a deal to uh, get their library of the old K-1 library and then some of the Glory events and started to take some time looking at the content and I could see the talent of these fighters, I mean their striking ability. Um, and so I got to know a lot of the leadership here and I was really impressed with what the vision was for the group, um, how invested everybody was in the product. Um, I knew it was a global brand with my experience having worked in London and helped to bring MMA and the UFC to, to the point that it was internationally. I thought that I could help. Um, so it seemed like a good opportunity. I had felt like I got a good little taste of esports, but I think what it ultimately comes down to is I really like fighting. I like watching guys and women go in and put everything they have into this moment. And it's not a team sport, it's just mano a mano. I've always liked that. So I'm really bullish on how we can position this uh, to be considered you know, on the same level as say the UFC. Uh, we are without a doubt the biggest brand in stand-up combat and we intend to go from strength to strength. So, uh, but it, it feels very similar in a lot of ways, but also like, it's a couple levers we can pull and we'll do some pretty unique things.